Hello and welcome back to the Railway Men. It's been a while, it's been about two weeks. Time has genuinely flown. Uh, so, I'll talk when we get into a game today. We play Atleti and then Wolves in the Prem. No, it, Wolves in the League Cup. League Cup quarter final. So, quite a big game. Wolves are top of the championship. They're going well, I assume. <clears throat> Let's have a look. There we go. Uh, yeah, no, they're going very well. I only lost one all season, which was Way at Notts County, who are actually pushing for promotion. Beat Bristol City. Football changes a lot. It changes a lot in about ten years. Uh, I mean, Wimbledon. Some things never change. Ipswich is still in the bottom three. Uh, but Oxford. Oxford above Reading. That's... I mean, Reading, how are Reading doing in League One? Oh, yes. Third. Hashtag Jose would never. Uh, okay. So, yeah. We could top the group with a win here. I think with a draw as well, actually. But we are at the Metropolitano. A lot of good memories from this place, though. A lot of good memories. Uh, Michael... Do Michael Duff? Michael Duff? Michael Duff. No, Murray Gunn, surely. Gunn and Pivovarov, yeah, 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 yeah. Fine. So, I took my break. Uh, I Do I feel refreshed? No, 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 I really don't. Uh, does it feel cooler outside? Yes, it does. So, I made the right decision on that basis, but... Yeah, it's good to be back recording videos. I have been recording a lot of stuff for the second channel. Uh, some of it may interest you, some of it may not. Uh, obviously, you'll have to wait and see. If you're interested in me playing other games, then I do recommend the second channel. If you're just here for the Football Manager, uh, don't blame you. Love this game if you're just here for the FIFA. Again, don't blame you. It's entertaining. I'll give you that. And, you know, it, it gives me the opportunity to shine as a creator. But, yeah. Update on me. Coaching course, done. Complete. Uh, I think I did quite well. I'm obviously not the... I'm not Guardiola level or <laughs> anything like that. Just yet. I've got a lot to learn, a lot to improve on. But, you know... Laugh! Mario Augusto is not as good as he should be. Jesus. No, he's horrific. Wanted by Man United. Um. 60 million is yours, okay? But yeah, coaching course went very well and I enjoyed it. And that's kind of the main thing. Even more than. You know. It going well, I enjoyed it, and that's that's obviously quite important. So yes, next up, my plan is we're going to hopefully step into step into some coaching. Uh. Perhaps not leading a team as of yet. We are dominating, so it's very frustrating. Augusto's having a terrible game. He's coming off. Yeah, no. Uh, I don't think I'm quite ready to lead a... You know, a men's team. I could probably do... Like, a under-15s, under-18s, you know... Between that sort of range, I think the younger players, I, I think, I I wouldn't find as easy because I have a lot of deep tactical ideas, and I think I'm I'm better at talking to people older than me than I am at people my own age. So actually, 
men's football kind of works quite well. But as a coach, because, you know... All right, Pevavarov, you've missed two sitters, mate. Ball in by Madrid. No, oh, back. I, yeah, this series is, it's frustrating. We don't need to win every game, though, obviously. Oh, what a, what a brilliant bit of play. Yeah, Victor. Unlucky. I mean, people say about not saying unlucky as a coach. I completely disagree with that, I, I think. You know, you have to say... Obviously, no, I, I get why you can't just go unlucky to everything. But when it is genuinely unlucky, you've got to say unlucky. But don't, don't just write it off as unlucky. You've got to think, well, what could have been done better in that scenario? But I, I think it's just, you know. <sighs> what, wins the corner. Good tenacity. Time to bring on Colo. And Luis Palo. So, yeah, no. Uh, that's all going well. I've had a bit of a break. I don't particularly feel refreshed. I'm going away on Friday. Uh, so I've got to pre-record a lot. I worked it out at about 14 hours of content. Plus I've got to edit up the documentary. Plus there's a lot There's a lot going on. Uh, I plan on bringing you with me. I might actually work on the documentary while I'm away in Scotland. Uh, lovely country. Planning on doing a lot of walking, building my fitness up. Uh, I am actually... Oh, we've lost. I am actually ap applying for a job. Well are asking around for a job uh, which could cause some problems obviously missing a bit of pre-season already then missing some of the friendlies because I'm on holiday it's not perfectly timed and I, I do have to go away because <laughs> you know I'd run out of steam if I didn't like I did with YouTube uh, obviously I'm back now and yeah Let's 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 head to the Wolves game, shall we? We need a big rest after that. And yeah, sorry, I, I forget how this works. It's been so long. I can't just stop talking. Yeah, <laughs> I'll see you for Wolves. Right? Can we make it to another semi-final? That's the big question. Wolverhampton Wanderers are opponents. Collock can come back in. And yeah. We've not got much rotating to do, really, with this team. We don't have any players. Uh, this is this is something I've got to work on for next year, of building up a team. Because we're going to have two... Si well, I say two series. We're going to have the league swap, which is going to be one every two weeks. But we're going to do a whole season instead of an episode every couple of days. So it's going to be like a review of a season, some of the big games, our live commentate, and then talk about all the other games. And then we're going to have another series. I'm not going to leak it just yet. We've got the league swap. But there's a lot still to be said about that. You don't know which team. You don't know where. You don't know all the ins and outs. There will be a video I will make probably this week. Might not release this week. It'll probably release while I'm on holiday. But I might make this week. Because I'm... Another thing I've got to say. Scheduled in for an eye test. Because my eyesight is going bad. Uh, I think I'm short-sighted. I think that's probably the one. Because stuff in the distance can be a bit blurry now. Uh, yeah. I, I, don't blame, I blame you guys. Too much too much computer time. No, obviously it's... That's fine though. Because I think... I've always been told I look good with glasses. Whenever I've worn sunglasses or stuff like that. So, yeah. Just about finding the right pair, I suppose. Fairly confident I'll be able to succeed in that. What a block! Impressive. Uh, but yeah, no, it's it's absolutely fantastic. I'm I'm really enjoying everything. And yeah, once I get my glasses, I can obviously play 
significantly older characters, I feel, by using different pairs of glasses. I could probably do that anyway, though. We're in. Oh, no! It was an absolute sitter. And he could have squared it. I've been enjoying FIFA more. Uh, I've got a new team. Uh, basically based around Herving Lozano, Team of Season All Black, and Davidson Sanchez. Uh, players I've all packed. That's a foul throw, surely. They're all fun to use. Oh, don't, don't concede, don't concede, don't concede. Don't concede, god damn it. They're a championship side, let's not forget. Oh, someone get there. Oh, Zani, the Australian. That's a free kick. Jose Roberto. He can hit them. It's a, not a bad strike, but the keeper manages to claim good height for him. Now, what's going on with Reading? Uh, some signings in the works. Goalkeeper from Everton. Uh, potentially Oliveira. We should get some funds for a Stacey deal to Bournemouth. Again, I wish Luton had just held off a season because they could have sold him for like 15 million next year. I reckon he's that good. Uh, so there's a shame we could have got well, what's 30% of 15 million? Oh my god, Malay! Our team is crap. Our team is really crap. Uh. Four point five million. Instead we're getting about one point four. It's fine, it's fine, it'll do. I say one point four, it might not be one point four straight away. But enough to ease our concerns on the FFP front. Plus Bedvarsden for about a mil, McCleary for about five hundred K, Gunter for about seven hundred K. They need to go to the same place. Are we heading to extra time? This is really not what we need. Equally I'd rather extra time than we lose. Championship Wolves at home. We are struggling. Badly struggling. Perhaps. Perhaps. I keep getting that wrong. Perhaps. It could be. That. There must be a highlight in this game left, surely. But I don't get it. We're so bad. Why are we so bad? We're champions of Europe. Straight to penalties. We're good at pens. Championship team have taken us to penalties. Francois Collot. The only one I think might miss. Scores! Ah, <sighs> Vargas. Yeah, Malay's not a very good goalkeeper anymore, I, I hate to say. Dimba. Oh, what a pen! I thought he blazed it over, but that is perfect. Because the keeper didn't move, I thought, oh, that's going way over, but no, no. Right, Malay, 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 Malay. No! Bloody hell, Malay! Nunes. 3 2. Malay, Malay, Malay. Come on. Malay hasn't saved one. Malay hasn't saved one. 
Jose Roberto. Shaky. Buries it though. Save this. God damn it, save this. Beckon. You're gonna you're gonna miss. You're gonna miss. Left footed. Genuinely Malay can Malay's second choice from now on, I think. Unless he does something incredible. We have Galal. Pivovaro buries it. Malay! 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 Vanek. Who is Vanek? He's a striker. He's 25. He has seven penalty taking. Well, that should be an easy save on paper, but it's not going to be. He's, he's going to. He's going to score. Oh, Malay. Wood. If we lose to Wolves on penalties after scoring our first five, it's fully Malay's fault for not saving one. What a pen. We're so good at penalties. Oh, let's just, let's just, come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Just, just hurry them up a bit, come on. Right, who's this guy? Me, me, he's a centre-back, with seven penalties aching, but he is a centre-back. So really... Should be saving this one, Malay. If it's on, if it's on target, that is. I think he might miss. Finally, finally. Oh, yeah. Aggressive. Win or not, that was a terrible, terrible performance. I don't really care. Let's come back for the Champions League draw. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh. Who's our backup key? It is Galal. I mean, he deserves a shot, doesn't he, maybe? I don't know. We're playing again in three days, so let's let's give the players a ho mini holiday. Obviously, we're doing quite a lot of travelling. What country is it in? It's always in Asia, it feels like. Yeah, Qatar. Good hosts. Uh, I mean that genuinely. Good host for this tournament. I'll see you back for the Champions League first knockout round draw. It We could be knocked out quite early on. It's a bit worrying. What are our expectations, by the way? Oh, bugger. Oh, bugger, I might be getting sacked this year. I might genuinely be getting sacked this year. Oh, dear. Yeah, I'm, I'm very nervous about this. We've got Pumas or Pumas, uh, in a Club World Cup semi-final, Mexican team, could be tricky. We want Celtic. Bring me Celtic! Oh, we're second seed, aren't we? Oh no, Monaco! Oh, we're out! He's made some progress. Didn't turn Greek in this one, though. Uh, as he did in real life. I know we got a team in season card, which I packed. I mean, yeah, the team's all right, but we're we're on pretty level playing field. Oh yeah, we should... I was going to say... Oh no! At least we avoided like a Real Madrid or a genuinely impossible to beat team. Anyway. Is he wanted by anyone? No. No one knows he exists apart from me. <gasps> Fifteen. Fifteen.
Don't need wingers. Uh, he looks alright, doesn't he? Zanari. I don't think we can afford him, to be completely honest. We don't really need fullbacks either. We've got two very good ones. Rudy de Freitas. Could do a job at Cam. A Reeman? They are a nigga. Jakub. Is decent. He's very decent. Villan Hueva. Who's not awful. I'll add him to my short list because for 38 million. It's decent. Oh, this guy could be insane. 58 million is a bit of a bargain for him. Who are you? We're playing 442 potentially. By the look of that. That 12 mil Portuguese centre back guy should be a shout. We should look at squad players. Like you. Oh, we're signing you. Oh, how much money do we have? I don't care. That is the biggest bargain I've ever witnessed. The Barcelona are interested. That's a problem. How about 5 million? With five mil up front. Yes, please. Great goalkeeper. <gasps> what? How? How is that possible? That's 10 million in the first season combined on those two players. Oh my god. Bargain hunting at the end of this episode. I didn't expect it, but it's happening. Oh my word. Sampdor... <laughs> That gives me a tingle downstairs. That is a striker. Shortlist. Who else do I have on my shortlist? Yes, stick him on my shortlist, definitely. Uh, you. If we go 7.5 million, going up to 10 million. <gasps> bargain hunt! Bargain hunt! Oh my god, he's a bargain hunt! Who are you? Ha. I missed, I missed the boat on that one. I mean, he has potential, but he's really not good enough right now. Uh, 
I'm guessing he's an old one, yeah. Again, another one we kind of messed the boat on. Uh, that was a Brazil, a Brazilian I saw. Doesn't matter. Right, next stop. I want another right midfielder. This guy. Oh my god. Oh my god, Portugal. Portugal OP. Portugal OP. 5 mil. Plus. We've just signed him. Potentially. I mean, wages might be a problem. Yeah, that'll do. For now. Gabriel Denis. Oh! That'll do. Five mil up front. So one of them to play centre midfield, obviously. And then do I have another centre-back? I could do with another centre-back. For, ch for cheap. Any bargains, any bargains, any bargains anywhere. doing Portugal mental what a Okay, okay, this has been going on for a while. Welcome back. We've made some additions. I'm going to see you in the next episode. Cheerio. Oh, I'm all excited now.